Hi everybody, it's Bridget and Mike and today we're doing a little something different. We're going to be talking about our new product launch. We have a new product. It's the Oval Snap It Core. Um, so to go over some of the key benefits of this new product to see if it's the perfect fit for you, I'm going to list some of the key benefits and Mike is going to explain, um, how they work. Love and, explaining stuff. Yes. It's our whole shtick. Um, so the first thing we're going to talk about is the greater impedance per unit volume. Yes, indeed. So the idea behind that is normal snap it, oval snap it. They're not all that dissimilar width wise um but this direction they're quite different now let's ignore the fact that this core is longer than this core although this core probably still has higher impedance um basically the impedance of a core aside from material changes is dictated by the cross-sectional area and the magnetic path length of the core. If you were to have two cores with an equivalent cross-sectional area, but a lower magnetic path length, then you can have higher impedance. And that core that has the lower path length is going to take up less volume in your design. So if you were to put two cables through a core with a circular aperture, you have a whole bunch of dead space around those cables. And that dead space is due to the fact that the core has a circular aperture, so it's taking a longer way around. Um, that is decreasing the impedance more than it needs to to fit the cables it's going over. And also in that, it reduces the size versus yes. the snap it. Yeah, so, so this can be this can be considerably thinner um, this direction while providing the same or more impedance in most cases. Um, and we have several mounting options on this design. So this Show design, the people. So this design has a couple of um, new features to it. So there are, if you can kind of see in here, probably not too well on the camera, but there are small teeth on here. Um, not thing that's too aggressively going to destroy the insulation on the wire, but that will help it bite in a little bit, stop it from sliding down. Uh, there are also clips on both sides of the wire here that's going to be able to facilitate a zip tie going around the cables, uh, one on each side of the core. So when both of those are utilized, not only will it help it adhere to the cable, stay stationary on the cable, it'll actually keep the case shut when both are used. Additionally, um, you know, these are pretty big cables, but ferry cores still do weigh something and they can put some extra strain on the cable. So there are a couple on the back side of the core ridges here so that cable ties can be used to secure it to something like a bulkhead or um, other bigger cables, perhaps. All right. And the idea behind this was originally for the automotive industry. Indeed. So automotive designed. Automotive designed. Um, so these cases, um, you'll notice they're blue, which is really a feature all <laughs> in and of itself. For marketing. Uh, but the cases themselves are made out of a different material than normally. So the normal snap that you see are polypropylene cased. These are nylon cased. So they're a bit more robust than these types of casements. So that's for a higher max temperature. Higher max temperature and just physically stronger. Um, that's the design change here too. And as the hinge is no longer a living hinge, the hinge is a, um, I don't really know what we want to call it, a hinge hinge, I guess. Um, <laughs> a real hinge. Dead hinge. A cylindrical Cylindrical hinge. hinge. Um, yeah, that's one to add a little bit of strength to the core. Uh, primarily, these things are not meant to be cycled a whole bunch of times. That can become a problem on a living hinge when you um, work the hinge too many times. These are, you could work it many more times. It's mostly a result of it being nylon that it's like this, but uh, it does add strength to it as well. Mm-hmm. And you can cycle it more times if 
you want to do that. Did you go over the enhanced coupling? No. <laughs> well, that's tell the people. Enhanced coupling. <laughs> so, yeah, in addition to the impedance being higher because of the lower magnetic path length of the cores, the other thing that happens, too, is uh, in a core like this with a circular aperture, that dead space is more difficult for the cables to couple to than if they were tightly surrounded by a ferrite core on all sides. So because we have less free space around the cables on this, they're going to couple better into the core. You're not talking, um, you know, a humongous difference across all frequency ranges, but at certain frequencies um, can be a pretty significant gain just from that alone. And they are also good on bus bars. They are also good on bus bars. So these are still meant to be used as a common mode core. So it would be over something like two bus bars that are insulated from each other. But this shape is better for bus bars. It, they're usually a rectangle. That's what kids um, say is bussing. This is pretty close to a rectangle. Yeah. So uh, to go over it, right, we got the, the new design, we got anti-slip grip. Yep. We got cable tie anchors. Sure do. We got new cylindrical hinges. Preach. We got high temp nylon material. Oh, yeah. We got lower air volume around the ferrite. Sure do. And we got cable tie ridges around that allow the case closure or bulkhead mounting. I think you already said that one, but we certainly have it well, in spades. Yep, we do. And uh, that's this new product. And it's blue, so it's definitely different from our normal casing. So you'll definitely be able to spot it. Um, we have this size, but if you're interested in anything else, please reach out. We have more sizes, too. Yes. And this is the one I have with me. Yeah, that's the one we were allowed to touch. Um, so anything else you want to tell the people about these oval snappets? Uh, I mean, I'm pretty excited. Buy about them. them. Available at a distributor near you, or not near you, or here. Call or us. Or here, yeah. And then maybe, maybe, just maybe, the oval core might make its way into something else. Also available in clippets. Bye. Bye.